you know what? Every time I met your show, at a show, you're doing a podcast, and I'll be passing by. You never want to interview me. Oh, I'm like, yo, this guy, dog. Oh, this guy. Yeah, because I drink a lot of juice. I have like, I have like three cans. Oh. Yeah, you want one? I could use some, yeah. Stay away from alcohol. Tell me you about see MB. the devil. Tell me about MB, You though. see the devil. The de- He's a liar. You see the, the devil. The devil is a liar. Yeah, we seem to be bumping into each other a lot lately. Do you like it? Do you hate it? <laughs> hey, yo. Actually, let me ask you this way. What are some of the misconceptions about you? Oh, <laughs> people think that I'm easy because I'm always out. You're also very smart about your crap. You're very smart about the way you move, and you know exactly what to do, when to do it. So I'm happy I that... I hope so. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, it's in the beat dive Africa, the rest of the world, what's going on? It's your boy TK, and welcome to another episode of The Juice 2.0. Oh, and I got so much love for you for stopping by. Returning subscriber, you guys are family, and I got so much love for you. And if you haven't subscribed, it means you're not part of the family yet, but it's very easy. And like I always say, click subscribe, mother flipper, and let the family grow. I'm at the Wise Soul Pop-Up House Party, nigga. Yeah, and we're having a good time. And look what the cat just dragged in, Casper, the DJ. What's going on, What's good? What's going on? What's good? How you doing? I'm proper, proper. Let's, let's, can, we, can we try this? Like, let's, let's see what happens. Let's just and if the if the comment section guys comment comment if I look better in those shades on these shades and if I get more comments though I know <laughs> no <laughs> no 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 yeah <laughs> what's going on me how you doing fam? I'm proper 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 good to see you man you're what's one up? of the people that I always bump into yeah because you and I are in the same industry yeah. You bless us with the music on the ones and twos. Always, always. We come out here with a podcast. It's a relationship. It's a, we we work together. You know what I mean? We survive off each other. But how you feeling? Tell me exactly how you feeling genuinely, man. Alive. Yeah. I mean, it's been... After COVID... Oh, yeah. Man, no, fuck that. <laughs> When I throw a hell a dog. It really ah, happens, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> COVID showed us dust. Yeah. Hey, COVID show- so right now, it's amazing to be getting these bookings, getting yeah. the love. It's it's nice to be where I'm at. For sure, yeah. for sure, for sure. I wonder how you survived COVID, though. Did you have anything else going on that's not musically inclined or... Okay, fortunately... Yeah. I lived at home, so... Oh, yeah. Uh, my parents had me cover through it all, but it was it wasn't the same. Yeah. Lifestyle no change a thing. Uta pakela we mahageeting, no car passing. Yeah. What's the name of it? I got let some planning. What's the name of it? No. Hey, it was hey, it was rough though. It was but rough. I'm glad I'm glad we're outside, man. Ah, we're we outside. You're also one of the most booked DJs that I see on the flyers when it's a weekend, when it's an event, bro. Yeah. How long have you done this thing? 13 years now. 13 One, years three. now. three. Yeah, 13 years now. And so I think I'd like to believe yeah. my blow up came just before COVID. Oh, yeah. The other, oh, when people say, oh, Mona, um, one hit wonder. Yeah. That one hit has been 10 years of working. So for a lot of people that don't know what the hit was, remind them what it was. What was your come up? Um, I think my first big show was yeah. me doing From 5. This is in 2012. Yeah. I don't know if you remember 48 Hour Funk Fest. I remember that, yeah, yeah. Um, I was a nobody. I had two years in the game, still a nobody. <laughs> And these guys put us after big nerves. Oh yeah. Now Batman Pinch have been some proper, proper, proper. Proper, yeah. We got in right after them. Give it up. I had a crew. It was called Strictly House Bound. Give it up for Strictly House Brown. There was five thousand people. Two people screamed. Shit. I saw both of them. Are you serious? Two people. <laughs> Two. People. I, and there were people I scolded. Two people screamed. That's crazy, though. And right now, 
from that to being able to go play for 50,000 people in places like Swaziland. Yeah, yeah. Man. Black, hey, dog. But I'm glad that you're here now. And you're at the White Soul Party. How yeah. you, what time What time did you land? How are you feeling tonight? I, I think I got here around to six. And yeah. it's an all hip hop event. When I get teddies on the decks. Yeah. So I appreciate that people are starting to realize that it's bigger than just the song. Look at Ben T. Oh, yeah, yeah. I love what he built with this. For sure. It's a culture now. Yeah. So the more we do this, Gaps has changed. Hey. Gaps has changed. Hey. And these guys are part of the people that have changed the life. Oh, uh, for sure. So before I let you go, man, top three hottest DJs right now. Teddy's not a DJ. Huh? Teddy's not a DJ. Teddy's, Teddy's not a DJ. Casper the DJ. <laughs> and then who else? Huh. See, I have so many names in mind right now. Right, 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 right. Can I like just drop a couple of names? Quest is amazing at mega mixing. Yeah, yeah. Um, Max has perfected his hip hop art. Right, right, um, right. Who else? Somebody I don't think gets his flowers enough is D-Lo. Who? D-Lo. Oh, D-Lo, yeah. D-Lo is an amazing DJ. I don't think he gets his flowers enough. Look at this nigga here. A piece of you. <laughs> you gonna stop by, yo? Come through. So it's hard to give a top three. But I definitely know Teddy's part of my team. And Teddy's on right now. Yeah, Teddy's on right now. And he's playing some of your favorite songs. Speaking of that, tell people what you told me before we started recording. What your favorite house track, I'm a piano track is. What are you He's a guy. Hey, yo. Hey. <laughs> So I was saying, <laughs> this nigga buggy, bro. Anyway, so, my favorite song. <laughs> it's been my favorite song for the yeah. past seven years or so. Um, Nana Chula. Nana Chula. I keep telling all of my friends when my casket goes down. That's the song I want to hear play. That's a dope track. Okay, not here, but I, that's the song I love. Say less, say less. Yo, give it up for my brother, Casper the DJ. All right, all right, all right. We're still at the White Soul Pop Pop Party, man. It's a house party and it's a secret location. So if we made it here, we must be some important motherfuckers, innit? Yeah, absolutely. You know absolutely. what I mean? Absolutely. And it's a pop up activation for what's yep. happening on the 30th of September, 2023. Why so? Piano Sunset. And the Day Club. And what? The Day Club. The Day Club. Yes, sir. So you better be there at 30th. I hope you caught your tickets. If you haven't caught your tickets, man, I don't know what you're waiting for. It's a couple of weeks now, and you got to get it right now before it's packed yep. and sold out. But I need you to put your hands together because it's part of the culture. He's part of the culture. He's poured into it. And tonight, we celebrate him. He's one of the hottest DJs right now. From here, he's going to play at Rhapsody's Bacalane. I need you to put your motherfucking hands together <laughs> for motherfucking... Max, what's going on? Wabana. Wow, Banna. Wabana. How you doing, brother? Where did that name come from? Um, it's it's quite the story. Um, it's quite the story, but it came from like uh, back in Boston, Koyubi. Yeah. Yeah, I was just chilling with um a bunch of women. Right. And I was creating my Twitter account. Right. And I was like, ah, Max was taken, Max one was taken. I was like, ah, Max Wabana, since I'm around women. <laughs> What's up? No, get out. For sure. I'm, 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 For sure. I'm good. <laughs> Jesus. Fuck, dog. Hey, yo. <laughs> yo, tell me, man. Yeah. Apparently, every time you're playing, right? Yeah. You're with a different girl. That's a lie. And people want to know, uh -huh. and this is the juice world, by the way. Okay. They want to know, how many girls do you have, man? I have my one and only girl. Huh? My one and only girl. What? So they lying. They lying. Oh, the streets are lying. <laughs> the streets are lying, my boy. They're lying. Tell me, one have, woman. You, have you played? Have you played tonight? Yes, I You've did already earlier. played. Um, Damn, some hip hop, dog. Some fuck, man. Some Kendrick Nyana, some what what Nyana. So I I missed that because I just landed yeah. a couple of minutes ago. Um, I mean, if you're coming back, you're probably gonna play. 
but it's all good. I've already, I've already had your sets, man. You're one of the hardest. Why do you think you're one of the hardest, though? And it's a compliment, by the way. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah. Um, honestly, it really right just... Right here. Ah, yeah. my boy. Sure. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Um, it really just comes with the passion, you know? Just love what you do and do what you love, and everything will pave its way. Yeah. yeah. So when you get an invite to come play at the YSO pop-up house party, yeah. what does it mean to you? How do you view, how do you view a YSO party? I've been with YSO since the very beginning. I remember the very first edition was yeah. right at this secret location. I've been with them for I don't know how many years, but yeah. it's been an absolute blast. Shout out to Band T and them, the whole crew. Yeah. They're doing amazing work and I've been here since so And it's a it's a lot of ass here too. I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that, my boy. <laughs> 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 Yo, you ever get used to like honeys screaming at you? Honeys just, you know, being groupies and all of that? Um, at, at a point, it's like, you know what? It just comes with yeah. what you do, you know? With the territory. So, so ah, It yeah, is what it is. It is what it is, man. So you just get used to it. It's like, yeah. fish up. You go to sleep alone, by the way. <laughs> you go to bed alone and text my babe or no, baby. I got you. I got you. Next day. Famo, good to see you, man. Always. Always, Always a good time to see you. Uh, so 30th of September? 30th of September. We're together, right? I'm, I'm going to be doing this on the 30th of September. Oh, can't wait. Can't so wait. the Juice 2.0 collaboration, YSO, Piano Sounds. Because these are my niggas. Yeah. And the good thing about it is that they're not just my niggas. They're actually paying for me to come too. Are. It's Casper. Fucking Casper, though. Yo. Yo, Cas, come, come too. Why should I ask this nigga? No, 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 you ask it, you ask it, ask it. Camera is right there. No, ask, no, ask, No, 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 no. Ask, just ask, ask, just ask, ask, bro. Ask. Hey, my friendship is on the line. No, 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 no. Fuck your friendship. Ah! Oh, it's a... Do it for the juice. Come on, Cass. Come on! When was it? When are we going to Cape Town? What I need. All right, so we still at the YSO pop-up house party, man. And I got royalty in the building. I remember the last time I spoke to her was at Gab's FM were having a good time. And then I started posting her clips and her videos and everybody loved her. Because everybody loves her. I love her. If I wasn't so taken, huh? She'd get it tonight. <laughs> she'd get it tonight. <laughs> Say hi to Kuma, yo. <laughs> What's up, mommy? I'm, hi! Hi! It's good to see you! Again! I know. Yeah, we seem to be bumping into each other a lot lately. Do you like it? Do you hate it? <laughs> hey, yo! <laughs> hey, yo! <laughs> anyway, how are you feeling tonight? I am... I'm tired, actually. Yeah? I landed from Joburg yesterday. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I had to be here. Look, I saw your pictures, right, on Instagram. Were you working in Joburg? Yes, I was working. Okay. I was doing, um, I was shooting content for Coca-Cola. Right, right, right. And then I appeared as a host on one of the episodes of a podcast. In right, South right. Africa, it's called Half a Corner Couch. Wow. By Khaled Sangoff Man, she's an actress. Yeah. And a bunch of, and like a bunch of other guys. They just came in together to produce a beautiful podcast. So I'm hosting season two, episode one. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. And then I put up fun here and there. I saw Trevor Noah live. Oh. I did one of his shows. Wow. Trevor Noah is amazing. Oh, my trip was beautiful. Dude, it looked amazing. It looked amazing. So what? Are we looking at Joburg, South Africa as like the new space that you're going to be working at? Are you I don't know. I'm still very scared, but I want to. Right. I've always wanted to. Well, the good thing is most of my work, I do it in SA. I just fly and fly out. Ah, uh, yeah. But like to be based there permanently, I want to, but I'm sort of kind of scared. Like, I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> you know, I was asking you before we started recording. The last time I spoke to you on Gaza from you didn't have that because it was covered, right? Yes. What What does it say? What, is, what so does the tab say? It's, it's Romans 8:18. Ah. It's my favorite verse. Um, right. It became my favorite verse after my mom passed sorry, away. Sorry, sorry about that. It's okay, babes. Yeah. Um, it became my favorite verse after my mom passed away. Yeah. It talks about how your present sufferings 
doesn't compare to the glory that's going to be revealed in the future. Right, right. So basically, don't dwell on what's happening around you. Right. You might be in pain, you might be crying, but what's coming ahead of you is so great. So it's like a daily reminder. You know, every time I'm like, I like and it. And I have another one here. It's called oh. Fear Not. Yeah. <laughs> it's written Fear Not. And then this is the one you know. Ah. And then, and then I have a, another hidden one. Dude, it's so good to see you. It's good to see you. What are you hoping to do tonight? Like, what kind of vibe are you looking forward to tonight? Because I'm tired, I'm yeah. just gonna be here to support Benji. You just landed, yeah. Benji's like my little brother. I've always supported him since the very first day. Since day one, yeah. And I'll continue to do that. Also, it's why so Piano Sunset and the Day Club. Day Club, yeah. I love yeah. these guys so much. So you're gonna be there on the 30th? Absolutely. One time. Wait, 30th, uh, yeah. September, I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be working during the day, but I'm definitely gonna come. Yeah. But I'm here because I love these guys. We're family, you know what I mean? We need to be there for one another. You know what Rihanna always says? Just show up. Show That's all up. you need to do. Just, Just show, show up. up. Yeah. <laughs> it's good yeah. to see you. Have a great time tonight. I think uh, I think I'm gonna take a few shots with you later on tonight. All right? Oh yeah. Yeah. Can we do that? I knew it. You. Oh. <laughs> I knew. Hey yo. <laughs> Guys, we do all like this. Do I think do as a I do, do, do the party has a crush on you, low key. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. At all. How do you know I, that? I can tell you as a question me, yeah. Yeah. I can tell you. No, 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 huh? Huh? I can tell you. No, I'm kidding. No, but Mdu doesn't have a question me. We're just friends. Oh, yeah? Um, That's what they say. That's what they say. No, like, for real? Yeah. Mdu is a really good friend of mine. You know mine. you never told me about your crushes in the industry, yeah? In the industry, zero. Zero? Yeah. I don't want to mingle in the industry. Zero. Zero. I don't want to mingle. I don't like dating in the industry. Bad idea. It gets messy. Yeah, so when I'm here, I feel like I'm with my people. That's it. I don't. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> Listen, I love you so God much. You. God bless the podcast. God bless the team. Amen. Keep on working hard. Amen. It's It gets tiring sometimes when you don't see it really the results. It really does, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I just need you to hold on. You remember the, the the thing that you told me at the last Why So? Yes. Yeah. You told I remember me, very well. You told me people are watching. Somebody's, Somebody's always, always watching. watching. Somebody is always watching. And you know from that day, I believed it. So thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love you so much. Come here, come here, ah. come here. All right, why so? Pop-up house fucking party out here in Chokwang. It's a secret private location. So I'm always gonna say this throughout the episode because we're here with some motherfucking important people. You know what I mean? At least to the YSO group, you know? <laughs> I need you to put your hands together for my brother who is doing the most, man. One of the hardest cats in B-Dub, man. It's gonna be, he's on the fucking line up for the delicious fans coming up soon along. DJ Mapurisa, Cab that is small, Maxwell, and a whole lot of other really, really hot cats. Put your hands together for the sensational do the party. What up, son? Sensational, I like that. Hey, it hey. What they do, play, bro? Must I kiss your hand so that it's the, no, no the need, things. no need. I appreciate yeah, it. I yeah, appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if I had a ring on, you would. But if you had I'm a chilling. ring on, yeah, what's happening, son? Chilling, cousin. You good? Welcome to the White Soul Party. Hey, man, we outside. And these are your people, anyway. Yeah, they're my brothers, man. Yeah, my brothers, my sisters, so when family. You, when you show up, you're having fun and you're also supporting Famo. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. They're Tell my me people. about. The, Tell me about how you're feeling about man the lineup. DJ lineup, the delicious fest, because I've seen that. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you, Brody. How you Thank feeling? You Brody. How you feeling? I'm feeling good about it. I'm feeling honored to be part of Botswana doing amazing things all over the world. Yeah. I think we're next, and we're showing them right now. DSCB delicious? Bro, I, it's surreal. Yeah. I don't think it has sunk in yet. Yeah. I'm, I'm so in the zone of preparing my outfit, my set, right. uh, the content. Like, I'm on work mode, so I haven't yet felt. No, you like you like. And it's of, coming, bro. It's coming. I know it's coming. And isn't it such a gratifying thing? Yeah. To be the most hardworking person because I think I think you are. Yeah. And to see the results. Yeah. It must it be is. gratifying, right? It is, man. And and it's also a testament to, you know, yeah. you gotta work, you gotta hit the ground running. Get you in can't there. stop. The other day I asked DJ Fresh if he ever gets tired. 
You know what he said? What to he me? say? He say he only gets tired when he stops. You're preaching to me. And you know that slump you get in when you stop and you have to get dog, back to work. Dog. Because we because we work, 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 work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want no slumps. Yeah. So it's good to see the results. I'm living in the now. I'm 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 harvesting. Bro. And you're definitely getting laid more. Getting laid? More. I wish. Oh! Now tell me about the tweet, the tweet that I saw the other time. Yeah. You're like. Was it on Twitter Circle? On Twitter, yeah. If it's on Twitter Circle, you can't <laughs> say it out loud. You know that, right? That's like the rules okay, of the not game. Twitter Circles. It okay. wasn't Twitter Circle. Okay. Wait, was it? Ah, shit. It might give have me, been. Give me the, the prefix. Alone cooking. Alone cooking? Yeah. Okay, finish it. Finish it. Tell me the whole thing. So you're, you're talking about, damn it. It looks like I'm alone. I'm obviously paraphrasing. Yeah. I'm definitely, I'm, I'm, I'm cooking alone, I'm yeah. cooking for myself, something like that. Yeah, yeah. What's um, up with that, dude? Um, uh, yeah, I'm alone a lot. Gang. <laughs> a lot of people don't know this. This I'm nigga. Party. I, I'm interpersonal, you know what I'm saying? For friendly, real, yeah. But like, I'm a lone gang. And sometimes it weighs on me. I'm okay with it. Yeah, of but course. But sometimes I'm like, man, I live alone, I cook alone, I clean alone. And, uh, but it I works. like people. You do, you do. Yeah, you people do. are good yeah. where they want to. <laughs> Dog. Yeah. So where you are now in the culture, right? Yeah. What's next? What is the actual thing? Because I know we keep growing, right? We are next. Yeah? Yeah. That's the answer. We are next. You are next. Who are next? My dog, let me tell you something. Yeah. Number two is the new number one. Right, right. I'll put you on that game, yeah? Number one is number one for obvious reasons that the best are doing it. I tell you. But number two is a very close second. Very close second. But number two usually eventually becomes number one. So all we have to do is exercise patience, be humble about our stuff. Humble, yeah. But we are next. And we being humble. But trying to be humble. Right now, possibly that's before me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In New York. Gloto was at New York Fashion Week. Dato Seiko and I on DSTV. On Delicious Delicious. Pet, bro. Bro. Um, Raul Bryan is a resident dog, of Dubai. Dog, dog. Kaneka Rio has been nominated for Gang Awards with Donna Mulusi. But Donna, outside, don't Fucking play hell, with us. Dog. Don't play with us. We're next. We're next. Dog, I'm taking it. Yo, yo. I just felt inspired right now. Yeah. Like, super inspired. And you're, you're one of the people to do that for me as well. You oh, know? for Cause, real? Yeah, I appreciate that. When I look at you, man, I'm like, shit. You're, you're also very smart about your crap. You're very smart about the way you move. And you know exactly what to do, when to do it. So I'm happy I that... I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> like, whoa, that for real? That's me? <laughs> hey, yo. But I, I love it, I love it, I love it. Tell me more, tell me more. <laughs> he does. He's just messing around. <laughs> You calculate your shit yeah. as far as work is concerned, yeah, right? Yeah, I haven't calculated. And yeah. anything else. Look, I'm happy to see you again. Always. How are you feeling about the YSO, though, when you stepped yeah. in? Yeah. Has anything interesting happened so yeah. far? Of course, man. I walked in. That's the most interesting that happened. <laughs> I hey, walked yo. in. No, for real. Ask anybody what happened when I walked in. I'm the only one who can. I'm him. So My new name is Himothy. That's Address it. me as Himothy from now on. That's it. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> Yo, put your hands together for my brother, man. Do the party. So, 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 before I let you go. Yeah. You got, you got BK Proctor. Is it a drip check? Let's drip check, bro. BK Proctor. BK Proctor. Five year anniversary team. Let's talk about how much it is, too. Woo. Yeah. Okay. So BK this, Proctor t-shirt. This is about 550. Okay. This is about 850. This is BK Proct as well, yeah, yeah. Yeah, BK Proct shorts as well. BK Proct t-shirt. Yeah. Diamond Dust Fanny Pack. Yeah. This is a classic. Classic. This cost me, I think it sent me back 450. 450. Yeah. And then um, I got new balances on. Uh -huh. You'll never see this colorway ever again. I got it for bands I, on I bands. Don't nah, but whatever bands he on says, bands. Right? Whatever you will he never says. see these again. At the 550s, the colorway different. You never see them again. <laughs> Yeah. We believe you, do. I did ass. <laughs> and then me, priceless. Yeah. You got tattoo glasses on. Of course I got tattoo glasses on. Local, 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 local. Everything local. local. You get me. And that's what I'm going to do at DSTV Delicious. I'm going to keep it local. You're rocking you local, dog. I'm going to do some crazy, local, heavy, crazy thing. 
So, because uh, it's a lot of people that are going to be watching you do your thing, right? Yes, sir. Tell them what they can expect on your ones and twos, man, at the Delicious Fest. Uh, the one thing you can expect is yeah. that I'm definitely going to be on stage. One time. So pull up. One time. Pull up. That's <laughs> all. But dude, I am so confident in this. I know I've, you are. I've never felt more confident. I know you are. I've never felt more confident. Bless up, King. Thank you, cousin. All the best. Thank you, cousin. And keep shining. Yes, sir. Represent us. Yes, sir. Every time you're up there, man, we feel we're included in yeah. that shit. Yeah, you know and what I'm I mean? including everyone. It is what I it want is. To... In inclusion! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Do the party. All right, so I just got like some of the most shocking news, right? These of you that don't drink alcohol no more. Yeah, we got change of things, you know what I mean? What's going on? Yo, man, I got really drunk in, in ghetto last week. I yeah. was like, nah, man, that's that's ridiculous. What, did you get up to some crazy shit? Of course. Ah, shit. <laughs> ah, shit. Of course. Ah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but it's like for two weeks. I want to see how far I can go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not for life. Dog. I tried that, man. I'm failing, bro. How long, how long was your... One day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is a serious guy, dog. Happy belated birthday, Thank son. Thank you, my G. I was listening to your show when I was going to ghetto. Yeah. Thank you for playing my shit for 30 I minutes, you. dog. I got you. Away, dog. I was like, you know what? Most times we're preparing for like the latest entertainment news. Yeah. And when we compile shit, we're talking about the United States, celebrities whose birthdays was yesterday, blah. I was like, fuck that shit. Let's do this. Let's keep it right here. You no know? one has ever done that for me, dog. For real? Hey, I got you. I got Respect. you. Anyway, are you, what, what's going on, man? You're, you're in ghetto. Uh... Uh, we were doing the BK Proctor show. Yes. Yeah, how, man, how, was how was that? How was that? Apart dope, from man. the... <laughs> apart... <laughs> it was dope, man. It's always nice to get out of gabs, you yeah. know. See, see the fans out there in ghetto. Yeah. They appreciate us. The support was nice. The show yeah. was, was dope, dog. I love that. Yeah. And uh, I was talking to a gentleman... His name is uh, Larry Don Cap. Yes. He was on my show today, on my show, on yeah, the yeah. Gabs of Him show. Yeah. And I asked him about his top three. And guess who showed up? Ah, uh, Vizo, Vizo, Vizo. <laughs> Man, whatever, dog. <laughs> so it was you, Benty, and Ski Mask. That's dope, yeah. How does that feel when you hear that shit, man? It feels good, man. Yeah. It really feels good. I've been putting in the work. So if I'm not in those lists, I'd be very worried. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. Mm. The recognition that you get now, though, mm. is different. Is, is it more than the past years? Definitely. People are recognizing me at shops now. Yeah. You know, they're like, Shit, oh, that's bro. Bizo. That's okay. Bizo. That's Last yeah. year, two years ago, I could just slide by you nicely. <laughs> Nice. Eddie, 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 yeah. yeah. But you had a white soul party, man. How is it looking here tonight? White soul activation party, man. You know, ain't nothing like a white soul party. They're for holding sure. it down. The dollies are looking nice. We're gearing up for the 30th, man. Yeah. At the same damn time, it's gonna be fucking, I can oh. swear, right? Fucking yeah. amazing. You can, you can. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be there doing the podcast. Yeah. And I got VIP tickets. You know what? Every time I met your show, at a show, you're doing a podcast. And I'll be passing by. You never want to interview me. Oh. I'm like, yo, this guy, dog. Oh. This guy. Wait. It Is happened it one time. One time, dog. One time. I you remember we had the DSTV thing at Skyview Lounge? Skyview Lounge. The white so, um, <laughs> the one with the flying fish background. When I came, niggas were packing up. No, they're like, nah, it's done, people. <laughs> hey, you guys are wild, dog. But, Okay. Let's say that's true, right? Yeah. You know why I've been avoiding you, though, right? Because you've been framing me on no! every show. <laughs> you've been framing me. <laughs> Bro, you're, pay you're paying these hands to say something. Lady. Every <laughs> Bro, every time it's a girl on my show, right? Yeah. And I ask them, your crush, whatever, what, what, what? Your name come up. I'm a good person, dog. I got good energy. You really do. Tell me what's happening with you and Muitepi. Ah, uh, we're good friends, dog. Scott, our son's coming out October. 
What's and coming up October? He's lying. My he's name. lying. He's, he's lying. lying. I just, I just asked him about Muitepi. He's like, we're just friends. I didn't even know, but he's lying. <laughs> Scott has coming lying. out in October. Next thing. Juicy Point O. Exclusive. Exclusive. Bees over you. Why so? It's lying. You are yeah, no. <laughs> It's lying. You see, you, heard it. you see what drunk people do at parties, dog. <laughs> Now I can tell what's going on here. Hey, yo, man. I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you, man. You're doing a fucking good job, dog. Yeah, yeah. You know? Thank you so much. I've got a new single coming out. Yeah, let's talk about that. October. End of October. New single, new chapter. I'm going to tell you guys some new news. New distribution deals. We're going international, baby. I love that. You understand? What am I featuring on one of your tracks, bro? Let me put some vocals on it. Dog, last, last time I told you, give me the regs, dog. You're now making money, dog. Give me the regs. Let's make a song. So, yo, what song is playing right now? Bow Wow. Bow Wow. Yeah. Like you. Is there, is there, is there somebody you could say these words to? Um, I can say maybe eight. Eight yeah. people. Eight? Yeah. What? My mom, my sister, my uncle, my nephew, my niece, my two other nieces. Yeah, you know what? Ladies and gentlemen, these of you. <laughs> and look out, look out for his new track coming out. Yes. October, what day? October. I'm saying the 27th of October, hopefully. One Let's time, do this. of you. Yes, sir. <laughs> Yo, I got Ben T, man. And I'm I'm just like, I should, I should be like super hyped up right now. Because <laughs> for the culture, you know what I mean? We're at the YSO house party, the pop-up house party. Yeah. Activating piano, YSO, and the day club coming up on the 30th. At of the same September. damn time. At the same damn time. Yes, sir. We gotta say it together. One, two, three. At, at the, the same, same damn, damn time. time. Put your motherfucking hands together for a bad motherfucking tea. What's happening? You shouting forever, for real. And the crowd goes. <laughs> Whoever's editing this, put the crowd screams in the back. <laughs> I don't see Tabs here. Where's Tabs at? Hey, Tabs. Tabs is editing. Tabs is working. Tabs is big now. All right, Tabs. I see you now here. Tabs is big now. But when you edit this, make sure this crowd goes. <laughs> <laughs> What up, fam? How you doing? Easy, my nigga. How so you doing? So first of all, thank you for having us. Yes, sir. Thank you, man. You know what I mean? I, we almost didn't do it, but almost. thank you to you yeah. for compromising, and I appreciate that so much. I wish I could do that. You wish you could do what? That. What's that? Oh, yeah. Come on. I wish I could. This is actually my old. I hate this hairstyle. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> it looks fresh. Tell me, man. What are we doing here tonight, bro? What's going on? Yeah, man. So we out here at the YSO and Friends uh, house party. It's a pop-up for the Same Damn Time event. Yep. We've been having different pop-ups. Uh, pop so Same Damn Time is a collaborative event between myself, YSO, YSO and Friends. Yep. And Day Club. Yep. And Piano Sunset. Dope. So they, we had the Piano Sunset activation a month ago. Dope. We had the Piano Sunset. No, no. Yeah, Piano Sunset activation a month ago. We had Day Club uh, two weeks ago. All right, right. And today is the YSO. 30th of September. Then 30th of September is the main event. I hope to see you guys there. Hey, bro, how much is the ticket, though? It's affordable, man. We have affordable tickets. It's, well, for here, we made like a, a special ticket, which is 100 bucks. 100 bucks. To get to the YSO and Friends, because we don't usually sell tickets for YSO nice. and Friends. It's usually invite only. Nice. So we're like, yo, man, we have an event in two weeks. Yeah. Let's let everyone that wants to come through. But you know what? Come through. What I'm a bit sad about tonight. Yeah. It's a lot of Father's Day, bro. What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> yo, it's a lot of dick here, dog. <laughs> so let me tell you guys. So right now, the time is 7:55. I don't know if you can yeah, see. Yeah, yeah. At 7:55. So in September, it's wedding season. So a lot of our people went ah, for weddings. So they're about to come late. Makes sense. <laughs> so the guys came early because they know at a white soap party, we're going to find. Because I was like, yo, am I lost or? No, 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 no. You just came early. You know, I've been calling you out for 
like a one hour, 30 minute conversation, right? Yes, sir. Because I haven't had that with you and I need that. But uh, like I told these of you, right? You guys are on top of the culture right now. You know what I mean? Is the money correlating to the type of effort that you guys are putting? Are you guys happy? I mean, I wouldn't say happy. Yeah, yeah. But we're okay because You're okay, yeah. We're, we're honestly only just starting the shit now. Right. You know, like before, it was yo book us for this and that, and we see how that thing works, man. So we decided let's throw our own parties and our own events. Yeah. And fix it up. So right now. We're, we're second year into our own events. Right. And I mean, it's now, right now, only now we're starting to see like the fruits. Right. You know, you need to spend money to make money. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's what it is, right? Yeah. Let's talk about relationships, man. You've been dating? Yeah. How long now? I think five years now. Yeah. I'm five years deep. <laughs> five. A rapper. Yes, sir. In Gap City? Yes, sir. Five years? Yes, sir. How? I'm Banty. <laughs> Banty. <laughs> I'm Banty from the White No, but so. on the real, man. On the real, bro. Like, how, how do you... On this, how, shit, Listen, though. guys. It's not easy. You know what I mean? Yeah. I won't lie to you and be like, it's easy. It's not easy. You just need to make a couple of sacrifices. And if you make sacrifices, that's how things work out. You know, I'm five years yeah, yeah. in now. Five years, yeah. I didn't even think I'll make three years. And before this, I was in another five-year relationship. So I'm a relationship guy. Never catch me in the streets. You know what? I thought I thought maybe I thought maybe it gets harder because of the environment that you're no, always in. You know, no, 100%. I mean? yeah. But the dope part is that I started my relationship while I was already part of the culture. Yeah. And I understand how it goes. So I got to learn it as a single nigga. Yeah. For like maybe a little bit. Yo. Please talk to Viz of you, man. About what? <laughs> About what? <laughs> Scratch that. <laughs> Cause it's like, TK, you're framing me. You're framing me. <laughs> But you know what? Look, a relationship. That shit is beautiful, nigga. It's amazing, bro. bro. Especially like when you're in this, when you're in the position that I'm in right now, it actually saves you from a lot of bullshit. Yeah. I've avoided a whole lot of bullshit because of my relationship. Is and that, thank you to my girl. Is that why you're always with her everywhere you are? Yeah. Make sure she's there where I'm at because yeah. you know. <laughs> What else you want to tell people, man? It's your show. It's your party tonight. Yeah. We're having a good time. Frostbite is on the ones and twos. Yeah, shout out to Frostbite, the hottest R&B DJ in the city. Yeah. You know, shout out to Juice 2.0. You guys have been supporting me from the very beginning. I've been watching you guys from the jump. Yeah. I've been fucking with the Juice 2.0 for long. <laughs> you know? But yeah, honestly, all I want to say is I hope to see you guys at the same damn time. Yeah. The culture shifting movement. Collaboration. It's, it's gonna key. be amazing. And that's what we wanna show, man. We're gonna be we're gonna be recording, so we're good. One hundred percent. So yeah. I hope other like events. I don't wanna say cause look, I'm not an event promoter. There's a difference between event promoter yeah. and uh event organizer. Dope, dope, dope. So I'm an event organizer. actually three. Three. There's event promoter, uh -huh. event organizer, yeah. and event curator. <laughs> <laughs> And he's an artist. <laughs> hey, yo. Get in the frame. Get it lower, 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 yeah. See this guy right here? He's my guy. <laughs> yo, is it true that he stopped drinking for two weeks? Yeah. What's in your hand? What's in your hand right now? He doesn't have anything, but he's not drinking. He's got money and drinks. No alcohol. <laughs> Yo, I appreciate you. What are we family. talking about? Oh yeah, <laughs> I was saying this event organizer, yeah. event promoter, and event curator. And I oh, feel yeah. like I'm an event curator. Curator. We curate experience. The vibes. Yeah, experiences. All, it's all what it's I about. I got you. I yeah. got you. So that's what we're doing, man. We're giving you guys an experience. So come through same damn time. Tickets available. Bro, web tickets. I'm gonna be in the VIP. So. The VIP. 
<laughs> First time it's happening in BW. I hope every other event, Get guys, your tickets. I hope you guys are taking notes. Yeah. Because collaboration is key, guys. Let's, <laughs> let's get together and make it a bigger mass. Now. Ladies and gentlemen, why so? Piano Sunset Day Club. Put I'll it out for creative. I'll be back for a full hour. Oh, yeah. Oh, we need you. Yeah. For an hour and 30. Yes, sir. Because you know what? I started asking you a little bit because, yeah. I've been avoiding this guy because <laughs> he's got too much juice. Oh, he's coming. <laughs> I've been I've been gathering some no, information. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. But I appreciate you, fam. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you for having us here. Yes, sir. I'm looking forward to the 30th. Thank you for coming. One time. Band Subscribe. <laughs> Juice 2.0. <laughs> Subscribe, niggas. <laughs> All right, so I got Melanie, and I need you to say hi to Melanie, who is also having a good time. Molly. 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 That's my social media name. Molly. Say hi to Molly. How you doing, Molly? I'm good. You're so pretty. Thank you, baby. And uh, you're at the YSO pop-up house party. What time did you land? What kind of vibe are you having? Um, I think I got here like an hour ago. Uh-huh. And the vibe is exactly what I'm looking for. Right. Something different. Yeah. My hip-hop buddy. Oh, yeah. Was so, was so tired of the I'm a piano. Oh, you tired? <laughs> I love I'm a piano. Let's not mistake Right, it. right, right, right. But we still want to head to our hip-hop. We still yeah. want that. So you're hip-hop head, huh? We've been lost a little bit. A little bit, because yeah. Because everybody is so into, you know? So we still need our little... Right, right, right. Your little corner there. Is this your first time over at the White Soul House party? No. No? This is actually my second time. Wow. Wow. And I went to the last one before this one. I think it was a White Soul Sunday. Yeah. By the warehouse. By the warehouse. And it was amazing. That was dope. It was amazing. I was there. I had a fantastic time. I think I saw you. Oh, yeah? Why didn't you say hi? I did. You say hi to me. You don't remember me? Okay, maybe I didn't say hi. Hey, yo. <laughs> but it was such a great event. Yeah. Shout out to the YSO boys. Benti and Shout out to Benti. Yeah. They're doing so amazing. They're you, know, giving us you know, I was asking you, like, are there good looking men here at the YSO? What did you say when I asked you that? I said, I'm looking at one. And I need to gauge a little bit. Molly, you go, you're going to get in trouble with that. You're going to get... <laughs> well... You're I single, need... though? Do you come out to parties like this, single? Or no, you're one of the... Because you're a good-looking woman, right? Unfortunately, I... Yeah. I have a man. Unfortunately? I have a man. Unfortunately? For men around you. Unfortunate for oh, them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not for me. I for get them. that. I get that. But I do have a man. So is he here today with no. you? Okay. He's traveling. What's the worst thing that's happened at a party? You turned up, you're late. What's the worst thing that's happened? What's the worst thing that has happened? Yeah, after a night out. What up, son? How you doing? I think the worst thing that has happened. Sorry about is, that. Is my friend. You know, because I'm a rock star, like, I can handle my drink. Right, right, right. I think the worst thing that has ever happened to me is my friends bailing out on me because they're too drunk. And oh. I'm still, like, ready to What's your out. What's your poison, though? What do you like drinking? I'm a brown liquor girl. Ah. I'm a Henny girl. Woo, woo! I'm a Cognac girl. Woo, woo! Oh. I'm a tequila girl. But that tequila is heavy, though. You know, I think that's one of the worst things about me. I can handle my drink like... Yeah, you I can drink you under a table. I can out-drink you. I'm sure of that. You want to put some money on this? Are we putting some money on this? We can. Okay. I'm going to find you later tonight. We can. Let's get six shots together at the same damn time. You, you couldn't out-drink me. When did you start drinking though? When did you start drinking? The crazy thing is, I've only been drinking since I was like probably 22. 22. I used to smoke a lot of weed. Oh. 
But I recently started drinking. Yeah. And it's like I can drink. <laughs> and you, I'm not man down type of like. I feel you. I feel never. you. How do you feel about uh, drunk sex? Drunk sex. I don't like drunk sex. Oh. A lot Ask of people me do. Why. Huh? Ask me why. Why don't you like drunk sex? Because I genuinely want to feel everything. And I feel like when you're drinking, what are you feeling? Oh, that's crazy. I want to be sober. Yeah. I want to feel everything you're doing to me. Right, right, right. And if I'm drunk, what am I feeling? Favorite sex position, what is it? Pardon? Favorite sex position, what is it? I hope your boyfriend is not going to come shooting. Like, ah! I don't want to sound boring. Okay. Missionary. But guys, mini missionary, eye contact. Like, baby, I want to see you. Get I want to feel you. Get out of here. No way. <laughs> missionary is actually one of the best sex positions. So you want to see the guy. Babe, I want to see you. I want to hear you. I want to look at you. I hey, think that's yo. one of the best things in the world. Like, <laughs> guys, it's not boring. Hey, you're really lit. Look, tell me about, tell me about, you've been with your boyfriend for how long? Three years. Oh, shit. So you're a commitment person, yeah? You know, the crazy thing is, yeah. I think having one person is so amazing. That's what I keep telling people. I've been in my relationship for three years, too. It's so, so amazing it, huh. to have a person who understands you. Yeah. And just... And fits into your routine. Like, right. it's so amazing. Yeah. The most amazing thing your boyfriend has ever done for you? Is take me to Dubai for my birthday. Dubai? For my are birthday. You, are you dating a rich, rich nigga? Hey, yo! Hey, yo, Molly. <laughs> I don't want to say that, but I just want to say that I'm dating someone special yeah. who knows what I love, who knows my love language, right, right, right. and knows what I like, and he's there for me. What, what, what's your love language, though? My love language is two things. Physical, affection. Missionary. Missionary. <laughs> Like, I love a man who comes to me and gives me something. I think that just gives a sense of, like, I'm thinking about you. Right, like, right, right. When he comes to you and says, babe, look what I got you. It oh, just yeah, makes yeah. you feel like you are thinking about me through your day. Like, I like that. I like he that. He said, baby, like, throughout his day, when he's not with you, he's thinking about you. For sure, for sure. It's not generally, like, materialistic. But it's, I was thinking of you. I got you. And I absolutely love that. You getting married? I, would you Would you like to get married? I would love to get married to this man. Yeah. I would love that. Hey, yo, whoever you are, my man. <laughs> He's very special hey. to me. Very special. So, the 30th of September, Why So? Piano Sunset, The Day Club. 100%. Are you going to be there? A hundred percent. I wouldn't miss it for anything. I'm going to be there too. So hope to see you there. I would love to. Be there. All right. Last word to everybody that's watching you right now. Um, Missionary is great. I would say have fun. Yeah. Do not care what anyone thinks of you. I think we live in a society where we constantly worry what people say about us. Yeah. Have fun. Don't give a fuck about what anyone says about you, child. There we go. Live your life. There we go. Because at the end of the day, it's just you. Marley, thank you very much. Enjoy the rest of the night. I'm very camera shy. So and with, oh, you're camera shy. Very camera shy. It doesn't look like it. But hey. Enjoy the rest of your night. I hope to. We're having a drink off. All right? You and I. We have a drink off. Let's see who the drink champ is. He's going to black out. Like, pray for him. Like, <laughs> pray for him. All right, Marley, everybody. All right, man. You know what? I was starting to get really scared. I thought the YSO, for the first time in history, 
has a lot of dick. But you know what? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We got some females in this. <laughs> Damn right. I need you to put your hands together for Mellow number six. Hi. Hi. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? You just landed? I just got here. What took you so long? I was getting ready. <laughs> ah. Dude, I was thinking like the ratio, the ratio is not balancing, right? Yeah. Like, do you see what's, what's going on? It has to be more honeys, less niggas, but yeah. now it's... But it's like a lot of more niggas. More niggas, less honeys. But you know who I blame, though? Daniel Kinosi. Huh? Yeah. Why? Because he, he went on Facebook, right? It's like, gents, these are the type of girls that you can expect at the YSO party. Don't say I didn't tell you, but this is where you find some of the hottest girls in B-Dub. So every other gentleman, <laughs> like, look at this. And I do agree, you cannot find any Piriahan apart from the white soap. Oh, party. yeah. This is definitely not the first time you're here, huh? Yeah, I've At a been, white soap. yeah. Even the very first white soap, I was here. Yeah. How you doing, though? What's going on in your life? Pardon? What's going on in your life? What's going on? How you doing? Nothing much. Yeah? I'm just living. The last, time, the last time I bumped into you, yeah? You're complaining that you broke up with your with your man. <laughs> False alarm, guys. False alarm. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you don't wanna talk about that? No. But what happened though? I don't wanna disclose anything. I was at my weakest point. Oh, for real? Are you so are, are you back with him or you're still single? You never broke up. You never broke up. <laughs> it's not make sure. I'm joking. It's not make sure. I'm joking. So you are single. What's meant to be shall be. Shall be. You probably want him back though. Who said we're not together? Oh, oh, okay. Well, whatever. <laughs> anyway, man. So on a Saturday, right? Mm -hmm. If you're not at a white soul like tonight, what do you usually get up to on your weekends? Describe your weekends for me. Um, wake up. Yeah. Clean. Get ready. Yeah. Go out. Yeah, of course. Ben of Boys said, I don't want to waste my days. I want to spend them on enjoyment. That's what I'm talking about. How old are you now, Melo? I am 20 years old. 20? 2 0. 2 0. Oh, shit! I should you not. Two zero! Oh my god. Turning 21 in January. Next year. You're looking forward to your 21st? Damn right. Do you have any plans though? Like party, going out, traveling for your 21st? I want it to be a surprise. Oh yeah. <laughs> and you're dating a guy that's really, really rich, so you're good, right? <laughs> hey, <GK>. yo. <laughs> hey yo. Hey <laughs> yo. You don't even know who it is, so. Me? Mr. Juice 2.0? Let's not talk about Mr. it. Mr. Juice 2.0? Let's 2. not 0. talk about it. Nigga, I know your man, though. <laughs> Let's anyway, not man, talk about it. What are you looking forward to tonight? What are you drinking tonight? I'm having brutal fruit. Brutal fruit. The only brutal fruit on earth. So that's what you go for all the time, or you could alternate with something else? Um... I normally go for, I'm a Jameson girl. Uh-huh. Jameson, Jameson over cognac. Right. Then for ciders, for my ciders, I have Brutal Fruit or Mayfair, Gin yeah, and yeah. Dry Lemon. Yeah, yeah. Celebrity crush? Drake. Drake? Dreezy? Oh! I know there's like a million of us <laughs> in life, but yeah, that's who I'm going for. What's your favorite Drake song, though? What's your favorite Drake song? Um, la cry, laugh now, cry later. Oh yeah, that's a beautiful song, though. It's a beautiful song. What local gem are you vibing to nowadays? Um, I think I'm still vibing to Le Poy by ATI. Ah oh, shit, that's yeah. a dope track. Would you, if an ATI concert costed five hundred for a ticket, would you go to it? Would you buy that I ticket? I would. Go I ahead. would. I actually would. I always wish to go there and I never do, but oh, yeah. Who did you come here with tonight, man? Who you with? Oh, I came alone, but my friend should be outside because she's calling now. 
All right, let me not keep you, all right? Yeah. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you. I appreciate you, but I need you for a longer period so that we talk about that other stuff that was there. <laughs> Hey, yo, okay. put your hands together for Mellow number six. Yes. <laughs> Let's have a sing off, though. Ad lib, ad lib, you go first. Can I be your fairy tale? I promise I will love you well. All right, my turn, my turn. Fairy tale, I promise. Hey. 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 <laughs> Are you going to sign me up, though? No. Do you, bro? Nah, bro. You know what? It was nice doing business with you, man. No, Thank no you problem, very much. No problem. Ladies and gentlemen, Hansi. Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> welcome to my Boy, show. Hey. I'm taking <laughs> over the show, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Hansi. And welcome to TK and Hansi. No, 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 no. Hansi and TK. And TK. Because it's my show. So, TK, how you doing, man? I'm doing great, man. Yeah, man. So, I see you have a girlfriend. Everything is good. You're having a great time. Yep. And there's a lot of girls here. So, yep. what are you going to do? Your girl is not here. What you going to do? I, uh... I'm very focused. <laughs> awesome. I'm very focused. Yo, speaking of girls, right? Who was calling you sipping key outside? You know, as a superstar. Huh? As a superstar. Yeah. And you have hits. Yeah. And you got hits. Yeah. So once in a while, but Okay. If you have one song, yeah. they're going to call you that for the next 10 years. <laughs> so nice, like different names, you yeah. understand? Yeah. Sibinki, Maloba, yeah. Sedilaka, yeah. Mafura Fura. So it was, just, it was just a fan? It was just a fan? It was just a fan. Hey, she's going to kill me. <laughs> it was just a fan. <laughs> you know she's going to watch this like, oh, so I'm just a fan. <laughs> Anyway, she is. She is. She is. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, let's talk about man. You've been you've been very busy, as always. Yeah. Um, what's happening next? Cause I saw you performing at the F and B Awards. Yeah. Yeah. How was that for you? And then we'll take it to the next one. No, it was it was it was quite amazing, man. I do yeah. a lot of um, those kind of shows. Right. Um, you know, Banka Moretz Tata. It's been amazing. The yeah. love has been amazing. So they should keep them coming, by the way. Because hey, <laughs> keep them coming. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. But you know what? What do you think? What do you think? And I hope I haven't asked you this question, right? Yeah. Because I don't want to be worrying. But what do you think it is about you and your craft that keeps attracting all these big brands? Because you're in this music industry and it's not just you, right? Yeah. But for some reason, and God God has blessed you with this. Yeah. You keep getting booked, you keep getting to these corporate gigs, you, yeah. you, you're performing and all of that. What do you think it is about you that keeps, you know, getting you attracted to this, all this? Uh, look, first of all, you have to respect your craft. Right, right, right. Um, people take um, this thing for granted, like coming yeah. on time, yeah. you know, because these people, they talk to each other, they communicate. Oh, you had Hansi last time. Yeah. How was he? Did he perform well? And um, yeah, we, we rehearse a lot. We, yeah. we, we put so much energy uh, into our craft, you know, you know, we make sure we bring it. Yeah. And you need to have a clean brand. I think that's one of the things uh, right, that right. uh, kind of puts me ahead. That's why you won't tell me who, who was calling you Sibin Kenneth. <laughs> you see, clean you brand. Want to, clean you brand. Want, you want to sabotage me, don't you? <laughs> you want to sabotage me, don't you? <laughs> no, man, but everything's good, man. They, right, they, right. They, they, they've shown me love ever since I started. So, yeah, yeah. yeah, I think that's it, man. I love that for you, man. And you have dancers when you perform, yeah? Yeah. Is this something that you have contracted? Or every time a gig comes up, you're calling dancers, or you already have your own dancers? So, I have three main dancers. Three. Uh, the ones that I take uh, with me all the time. Right. And then, you know, we sometimes go to to do a lot of sound checks. Right, right. Uh, to see how the stage is, just to get a feel of what's going on. Yeah. So, if the stage is too big... It's got to be a few more. Yeah, we, we've got to add more. And Liwane, um, it's not like they are... It's not like they are my dancers, Kilunos. Right, if right. Samantha Mowe wants, yeah. wants to hire them, they can also uh, go dance for Samantha yeah. Mowe. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. You are still not drinking alcohol? Welcome to the <laughs> juice. 2.0. <laughs> no. 
Yo, yeah, well, tell me why you always I have bought a, a... I bought a six pack. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. You should be like a brand ambassador for the Juice 2.0. Yeah, because I drink a lot of juice. I have like, I have like three cans. Oh. Yeah, you want one? I could use some, yeah. Stay away from alcohol. <laughs> Drink responsibly. <laughs> so, yo, tell me you about MB. You see the devil. Tell me about MB, you though. You see the devil. The de He's a liar. You see the, the devil. The devil is a liar. Do you see that shot? Where did it come from? Do you see that shot? <laughs> I be dodging bullets, like... Anyway, tell me about MB, right? Yeah. What's your relationship with MB right now? MB is um MB is my boy. Yeah, yeah. He's my day one. Right. You know, um, ever since You guys made a track together at some point. Yeah, appreciate yeah. it, appreciate it, appreciate yeah. it. Yeah, no, MB is my boy. He he Let helps me, me out that. with Aye, man. The I'm devil. A... The devil. Woo! Dear Lord. <laughs> Bless my boy. <laughs> Bless my boy. <laughs> Lord, give him the strength. Should I take my cap out? Should I Lord, take my Lord, give him the strength <laughs> to stay away from alcohol. God, he's drinking. Hallelujah. While he's working. Hallelujah. Jesus. Amen. Yeah, you're good. Amen. You're good. I wasn't going to take the cap out. Pandani is, is heavy. God damn. Yeah. Let me see. Hey! Let me see. Hey. Let me see. Ladies and gentlemen, TK is about to reveal his stadium. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Hansi <laughs> is leaving. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. The juice 2.0. I'm not leaving. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. So the cameras are rolling right now. Yeah. You know? Okay, yeah. You should have given me a, given me a, a warning before we started. I told you last time. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, come on. Okay. Is it really that deep? No, continue. I, <laughs> no, be free. Be free. So, the last time I checked, you're not you're not seeing anybody, yeah? You're single. Has that changed? Yes, that has changed. Oh, that has changed. Oh, where is he? No, he's not here. I guess you're not here, Rodney. Why not? Who would you put me with here in this? <laughs> anyway, I don't draw line gaps. Yeah. Anymore. So where's this guy? He's in Joburg. Joburg. So a long distance relationship, does that work? Does that not? It does work. Yeah. Actually, it works best for both of us. You know, I I had a conversation with one of my colleagues at some point, lady colleague. Yeah. She said she prefers long distance relationships because she doesn't want to be, you know? Do you feel yeah. the same? I feel like, you know why I feel like long distance relationships works for me? Yeah. Because I'm, I don't want to say the word clingy, but I am clingy. So it works best if you are gone because when you come back, my clingy makes sense. Yeah. But like if we're together all the time and I'm clingy all the time, I feel you. It gets a bit irritating. Yeah. So I'm like, Damn. yeah. Do you think it's hard or it's easy to date Abby? It's easy to date Abby if you understand Abby. Abby. Would you date Abby? I would date Abby. Really? Look at me. <laughs> I'm a vibe. If no, you I mean, love like, a vibe, if okay, you love okay, a vibe, of course, if of you're course. a homebody, I don't, I don't think dating me makes sense. Okay. But if you love like the scene, yeah. Dating but you, me but makes you know sense. what? I, what I was really asking, right? Yeah. Is like knowing what you know about you. Yeah. Would you date you? <laughs> yes. Yes. Okay. I'm a vibe. That's why I'm here. Yeah. So look. You're quite a you're quite a party girl, yeah. Yeah. Do you feel? Actually, let me ask you this way: What are some of the misconceptions about you? Oh, um, people think that I'm easy because I'm always out. People think that like, hey, oh, because Abby's out, it means more. If you want it, you can get it. Oh. Well, yeah. Ganti, Ganti, Ganti. I'm the most unlinkable woman. You in seem Kaburoni. like it. Yeah. I really am. Or 
I'm really nice, so I think that type, that that um, conception that people have of me is okay. Yeah. But like, I'm trying to think of something else. Oh, when people think that I can win them on gigs. Like, oh, hey, Abby, because you were on TK's podcast, can I DJ at, at Deja Vu? <laughs> How can I do that for you, darling? Me, I'm just out. I'm just having a good time. Yeah, that's one thing that I people think I have, like, honestly, I know all of you guys, but that doesn't mean we're connected like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I also feel like people like, I, you have connections. Huh? Man. Chill. Even Relax. if I did, I feel like if you don't know me, don't approach yeah. me on that level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a bit weird. I feel that. Yeah. I feel that. You you're quite a you're quite a different person. Very How interesting so? person. How Very so? interesting person. Uh-huh. Because I mean the way you are, you know. Okay, tell me more. How? I don't want to get into it. No, you have to get into it. Uh-uh. You can to the body count that 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 you can't get shy now. You can't get shy now. So how I just, am I I just think that with what I know, the little that I know about you. Yeah. Being such a brainiac, I mean, you studied law and all of that. Yes. And then there's this other part of your life. Like, I don't even know how how possible it is, but for you, it's been so possible to have this kind of lifestyle and have that kind of background. And I'm like, you gotta be the most interesting person to merge it together and still survive and have a good time. Ah, uh, is that why you want me on your podcast? <laughs> Great question, though. Okay. If I ever asked you to host the Juice 2.0 podcast, you've been the host and invite guests, would you do it? Yeah. You would? With the nature of the Juice 2.0 and the car? I think I would, because I'd, I'd know who to invite that's ready to answer those types of questions. Can we do it? <laughs> yeah. Because I feel like you surprise people with their questions. Me, I don't want to surprise anybody. I want to be like, dog, you know when you're coming, I'm going to ask you about your body count. And then like, yeah. Are you asking me now? What's your body count? Me? Yeah. Two. Why, yeah, I got two. Two? TK, how old are you? I'm 32. And it's someone and your girlfriend. Uh, yeah, someone, my ex, and my girlfriend. I'm happy for you. Thank you. What's your body count? Two. <laughs> hey, yo! Cap! 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 Basis? Cap! Basis? 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 I got evidence, though. I got my niggas. You I know? don't have evidence because I don't have a child. I don't have a child. So even if oh. I told you my body count was zero, you have to believe me because I cannot want that. okay. My body count is 67. How about when niggas talk though, like, yo, I hit that? Huh? When niggas talk, like, I hit that. Doesn't that count as evidence? No. It's you not proven, it's not you proven. You didn't hit that. <laughs> Man, me. I Abby, can be like, who? Abby, why do you hate sex so much though? I don't hate sex. Why do, why do you hate people talking about it so much? I don't hate people talking about it. You I hate should, me for I talking about it. sex. Thank you. You hate I'm me. I'm glad that you brought that up because I don't need to speak about it. Ah, shit. Lay it on me, lay it on me, lay it on me. Okay. Yeah, let's hear it. Should I actually say yeah. it? Okay. My thing is, what's your, what's your thesis statement in your podcast? You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, what was your... This is what I don't understand. I think that's why I'm like, maybe I'm wrong. Because I don't understand what your podcast is about. If it's a sex podcast, then I'm wrong. But if it's not a sex podcast... Right, right. And every time somebody's here, you ask them about sex, then... What's your story? <laughs> I hear you. No, you're on the no. Come answer me. Answer me, so, darling. So can I answer this? Can I can I answer this on the next part? Yeah. Next part of the Juice 2.0? Okay. Can we do that? And then I should come on the Juice 2.0. Yeah, because I need you for an hour and a half. Okay. Can All we right. do that? We can do that. Because you remember you wanted to go ahead at, yeah. go ahead at me yeah. on, a, on a whole. Yeah. When can we do that? You have my number. 
I do, yeah. Yeah, so we can... Yeah. Yeah. I've actually never used your number. i got to start using you it. You haven't. No, you haven't. Like, yo, can I take you out for lunch? No, thought that he hasn't. As for girlfriend, boyfriend, whoever like, you are dating, he's never asking me for my number on bad. Boring! But, okay, he wants me so bad. Hey, 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 hey! hey. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Abby, thank you so much, sis. What's going on, YouTube? My name is TK of The Juice 2.0. I'm just here to say thank you very much for checking our video and click subscribe, like, and the notification button for more content just like that.